Yo, what's up guys, welcome to another video. Uh, right now we're two hours, yeah, two hours away from Auckland, filling the boat up with gas, just out there. Um, and we're on our way to Materi Bay. Um, I'm so excited, got everything packed. And uh, we're gonna have a blast. Two weeks staying there. I'm gonna f try and film a, lo a lot of it and yeah um i guess i guess i'll film when we get there all right later since we've got here um we slept in the boat oh it's over there you can't actually see it um well we're waiting for mum to come so we can set up the tent because she's got the tent so yeah um I guess I'll film later as well later <laughs> and they didn't catch any fish well they caught heaps of fish but there were heaps of tiddlers <laughs> but dad went diving and he got this nice pack horse yeah and we're yeah. gonna cook it up on the barbecue now and yeah hopefully it tastes nice yeah it's gonna taste good buddy <laughs> all right Alrighty. I'm just chilling out there in a bit of water Alrighty. cool What happens when you use a big knife and a slippery crayfish? <laughs> oh. 
but that worked out. Nice camera shot. <laughs> And won't that just cook like straight into it? Yep. Once it gets oh, now it stops moving. Just reacting to the salt. <laughs> oh, there we go. There's a little bit of movement going on there. Oh. <laughs> See how fresh it is? <laughs> yeah, that's how fresh it is. It is still moving. <laughs> has been shut down to mainly though. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> yeah. Oh, no. oh, oh, that's so good. <laughs> boy. Oh. oh, look at that. Five minutes later. <laughs> All right, so today we went spear fishing out just along the rocks just out further off the beach but along the right side on the reef around there and uh, we got a big haul of butterfish oh thanks baby mm. i shot two dad shot two i mean four and then we caught i mean some other people Rick and Mark. shot some as well Alrighty, so this is what a butterfish looks like. This is a male. A bit of a bullet hole in it. Yep. You can tell male and female by, so this one will be a lot more like browner. And females, they'll be more like on their stomach they'll be more kind of yellow, yellowish orange and also they'll have these silver spots along there, along the side of them. And you can see nice white meat. Beautiful meat. Let's leave all the stomach cavity there. Chop that. Take out the spine, just in there. And there we go. Beautiful fish. Really nice, fresh, tender butterfish. Hmm. Alright, so I actually thought I might just grab a female to show you guys. Um, as you can see, they've got kind of a much orange, orange belly, and see, you can see these way better in the water. But these little silver spots here, they shine out real well, so you can usually uh, tell that they're a female. And how um, me and Dad usually figure out that <laughs> it's a butterfish. We look at the spine; it's quite square shaped the fin the fin and yeah you can almost make like a burger out of it yeah you know what that, I mean? That one's full, I can feel the weight on that one, even though it's not that oh, big. You feel yeah. the weight on it. Yeah, it's so day. big. That's so my hand. Yeah. <coughs> Alrighty, so we're going for a kingfish hunt and found this big school of fish at Tahiti Reef and yeah, that's your valley and uh, we're gonna go see if we can catch a kingfish.
or something. Yeah, alrighty. Alrighty. Got a fish. Don't know not what it is. Nice little snapper. Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh uh, yeah, there it is. Yep. Oh yeah, there it is. This guy. <laughs> oh, it's gone. It's gone. Spat it. Yeah. Ah. Come on. I do. It's just the car way. There you go. Oh. so you can see him, okay? Yep. Just a cow eye. Here we go. Alright. Let him go. Yep. Decent size. Swallowed it down too. Shit. Catch any car wide, but we're gonna go for a snapper fish now. So, yeah, see so you at the spot. So, we just caught this granddaddy harp hooker. Flip them up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Have to be super careful of them because they're Spines very poisonous. are poisonous. Yep. And if you're catching these guys, because they're not very good swimmers, it means there's not a lot of snapper around because they can't compete against the snapper for food. So, that's we're gonna move. Got another spot. <laughs> nice no, snapper. Ah, might be a little small, actually. Now I'm going to show you guys a tour of the camp. So first you can walk up this track and you can walk up the top of the hill and you can see all around the water. But this is Rocky Bay. Go diving through here. Real good terrain. Here's some rocky areas. That's why we call it Rocky Bay. This is the actual Terry Bay camp. Got the beach there, all the camps, and yeah, we'll go up to the top of the track. So this is the top of the hill. Real nice view. Got to be careful because there's the drop right there. 
And if you trip down there, you're gonna. Alright, now I'm gonna show you how to turn inside again. So first we have the laundry. Pretty simple laundry. <laughs> then we have the kitchen. This is kind of part of the wash house where I mean, you've got some dryers here so you can dry all your clothes as well. Then we have the toilets all around here. Got the wash line and over there we've got the recycling bin so you put all the cans and beer bottles and milk tubs and whatever and the cardboard. And this is kind of like the centre of the camp. Well, it tends to get everywhere. And if we walk over here, we've got Rocky Bay. I'll go show you. Then if we walk over here, we've got the main beach, which goes all the way over there. We've also got the filleting station. Over here we've got our fin site. And last but not least we've got our campsite. Got the track, boat over here, got surfboards, stuff, and we've got the tent, the table there we eat dinner, camp chairs, come in here. This is basically like the pantry, got all the food in there. And we've got cutlery, water, fridge, radio, plates and pots and stuff. And then we go over here, got my bed, mum and dad's bed, and stuff, and yeah, all that stuff. And that's basically it. guys we're leaving now hope you enjoyed this quite long video and um see you in the next one